The University of Buffalo is the largest and also the most comprehensive research university in the state university system in New York. The department has three major areas. One of them is condensed matter physics, both experiment and theory, high energy physics, cosmology and astrophysics, again in theory and in experiment. The other group is biophysics, again in both theory and experiments. These areas provide our students with a lot of opportunities to pursue their graduate studies. The biophysics group at the University of Buffalo is a collection of researchers that are focused on understanding protein dynamics, interactions between proteins, both inside the cell and in the cell's membrane. And we do this through experimental techniques where we actually develop new techniques as well as computational techniques. Students in our group have the opportunity to address fundamental questions associated with protein dynamics and their impact on function and then performing the experiments using visible to extreme infrared light. The HEPCOS group at UB is a collection of high energy particle physicists as well as cosmologists. So we are a group that looks at the fundamental forces of nature at and their behavior at the smallest possible scales and also relates them to the behavior of the universe at the largest possible scales. The HEPCOS group usually employs between five and ten students per semester that, and they can do anything from predictions of the inflationary parameters for the, that they, for the, for the universe that they can compare to um, say Planck satellite data to predictions of uh, very, very precise calculations of different strong and electroweak forces interactions that occur at the Large Hadron Collider. And they also can be students that actually are going to the Large Hadron Collider to collect the data and do analysis of these, of these collisions that we can actually compare to predictions. There is a strong culture of collaboration within the physics department. And the uh, condensed matter physics group is uh, no difference. And take my group for example, we actually collaborate with every single condensed matter physics group in our department, both experiment and theory. Graduate students are engaged in cutting edge research, uh, ranging from material synthesis to uh, fundamental understanding of material properties using low temperature uh, charge transport and optical measurements and device fabrications. Uh, the students are highly motivated and they are working hard to producing uh, exciting results and uh, they are publishing in prestigious journals within a short time frame. My experience here at UB so far has been really positive. I get to meet new students from all diverse background and the faculty that I've been able to interact, uh, they have really have a really strong research background. From them, I get to learn a lot of new skills which uh, I can use to build a better career and become a better scientist. My area of research is condensed matter theory. So it's a broad area of physics where one covers uh, aspects from inner mathematical beauty of phenomena around us to potentially new class of applications. I had the privilege of working with many gifted undergraduate students. First they started uh, as students in the courses that I taught and then after they expressed interest in my research we tried to find together what would be a suitable type of uh, research topic for, for them. Some of them have received uh, most distinguished awards uh, like Goldwater Scholarship or multiple National Science Foundation graduate fellowships or Department of Defense uh, graduate fellowship. The physics department currently graduates 20 physics majors every year. They are really the stars of the department. In the last three years, they received three Goldwater scholarships, one honorary mention, 
and also four graduate research fellowships from NSF and DOD. I've been doing research here for three years. I started off in the summer after my freshman year and I've been doing independent studies with professors ever since. The project that I've been working on has resulted in a publication and I've presented it at conferences like Boost last summer and at ICHEP 2016. I've also presented at various research fairs at UB. I first became involved in research at UB during my sophomore year. The university has a great resource called the Center for Undergraduate Research and Creative Activities where professors who are particularly interested in working with undergraduates can post information about their research. I contacted a professor whose work on complex systems sounded very challenging and engaging to me, and ever since then I've been working in Dr. Sen's group here at UB on theoretical nonlinear dynamics. The goal moving into the future is to make the department an outstanding department in the country. This will include improving the quality of our research and also the quality of our education. We'll make it a place so that our faculty members and our students will find it easy to grow.